Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve the Windows Update Error Code 0x800F080A that your device is missing important security and quality fixes. There are problems installing some updates, but we'll try again later. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. First thing I recommend doing would be to actually go ahead and actually retry the Windows Update. So there's a button that says Retry. I recommend retrying it and seeing if that might clear up the problem. If it doesn't, which I won't be shocked if it doesn't, we want to go ahead and open up the search menu now. Search for Troubleshoot. Best match or come back with Troubleshoot Settings. Go ahead and open that up. And on the right side, you want to select Other Troubleshooters. And then underneath Most Frequent, select the Windows Update Troubleshooter and the Run button. And hopefully it's able to resolve the issue. If you're still having a problem, something else we can try here as well. If you open up the search menu, type in CMD, best match, or come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select to run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, you want to select yes. And now I will have two commands in the description of my video, guys. Go ahead and copy the first one. It's the system file tracker utility. And then go up the top bar of the command prompt window here, right click on it, select edit, and then paste it in. Hit enter to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. Okay, so once that scan is done, go ahead and copy the second command in the description of my video, and then right-click on the top part of the command prompt window, select edit, paste that one in as well, and then hit enter. Okay, so once that's done, go ahead and close out of here and then restart your computer. And there you go, guys. Hopefully now if you go ahead and proceed to check for Windows updates, you should be good to go. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.